There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, loves? What's up, debugs? What's up, debos? It's your girl April. You guys already know what time it is. It's time for a hair tutorial. I know, I know, I got a wig on already, but now this one that I have on, I did not make, which is cool. We're not about to talk about this one, but this one I did make, and I'm about to just toot my own horn because I'm saying so. I finally mastered the frontal thing and the hairless hair. I have worked with them on numerous occasions. Like when I say numerous, like seriously, I've worked with them enough times to like we should be like besties like this okay um this one this time around i was like oh i'm gonna request a lace frontal because your girl is about to be bougie not really on that sense but i'm just saying i told y'all there's a cult for making wigs it's called the wig witchery cult okay you gotta slowly step your way in and you you not know magic 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 tree or kind of witchery and stuff and spells and once you learn these spells and stuff you got a down pack you can just take out your lasso and you can or your little spell wand it's like harry potter and you can make the way with no time no problem no issue you know what i'm saying so now i welcome i welcome a challenge no problem because i'm telling you what ain't nobody perfect and it takes some time to learn some some stuff okay i was about to say the the s word but i had to switch it up a little now this one right here, they sent me four bundles of their loose wave hair. I think, I'm thinking this is like 24 inches because this bad boy is long. 24, 24, 22, 20, and I think it was like a 20 or 18 inch frontal. Uh, not a 360, but a frontal. Your girl almost had almost four bundles on here because I will sew the heck out of a wig really close. I put the combs up in here. I put the elastic band and I even wrote the name on it because if I don't write the name on it I'll be like which company is this that I made the wig for anyway you know what I'm saying I even let me tell y'all I even tweezed the hell out of this frontal because I'm not gonna give them all praises due like okay on a scale of one to ten what I'm gonna rate this I'm gonna rate this like a, a seven and a half because it was very 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 thick at the hairline very thick at the hairline it looked like one of those sumo wrestlers you know what i'm saying very thick at the hairline it was like no hole untouched you know what i'm saying no hole untouched every it seemed like every hole in this lace frontal was ventilated with some hair so i was like i can't no girl i can't get on it so i tweezed i tweezed and by the time i finished you could have made yourself a closure with all of the hair that i tweezed out and it still is nice. Now, let me tell you, after I finish, finish my witchery, it looked so pretty. Like, so for this one, I did hang it upside down to dry. Once you hang it upside down, you get in all the ways. You see that they pop in. They pop in. Y'all cannot tell me that they not pop in. More or less, they have some really amazing hair. And their customer service is, you know, just as nice. Okay, sure, I'm going to be using my, um, well, you know what, I'm going to put it on now. This is the hair gel that I've been using, which is the Gorilla Snot. I'm going to just take a little bit and rub it on my edges. Okay, so as I was saying, 
fine. The hair, listen. I don't really be tweezing too much, but I'm going to tell you, like I told y'all, it was very dense at the hairline. It was very, very thick. So it definitely, definitely needed like some tweezing. And a girl did her thing. Do you guys see that? Like seriously? Uh, it fits so snug and it fits perfectly. I'm so glad that I decided to add the elastic band and the combs. You know, your girl cannot go without combs. But let me tell you about the hair. So the only time that it really actually shed was after I tweezed it. Like I said, I tweezed a lot of hair out of this frontal because it was very dense. I was like praying to the wig tree gods, like, girl, please don't do too much. Please don't do too much. And I actually did a really good job with the amount of hair that I took out of it. The waves are beautiful. I did hang it upside down to dry. It's very long, like for me, but you guys know I love long hair and I love loose wavy hair. If it's loose wavy, Girl, you don't have to do nothing to it. Now, I wish I would have dyed this hair like I did another unit, but unfortunately, I really didn't have time. But let me tell you something. Peerless Hair has some really affordable hair. Like I said, I've worked with them on numerous occasions. I would not doubt them. Um, the only thing I think that they really need to work on is their fronts. Was like, I don't really think that they should put hair in every single hole. Like, seriously, like, just just fall back a little bit but I mean if you know how to use a good tweezer and you know how to do it then by all means I didn't do this wet like I didn't tweeze the hair out wet I actually after I finished creating the wig like as soon as I was done I still had it on my mannequin wig block head and I just tweezed it as I was watching basketball wives and by the time I was done, I was like, oh my God, that's like a lot of hair on the floor. But it came out really easy and it left like little black specks in it, like little black tiny hairs. And once I washed it, I got a toothbrush and I brushed it out of the lace and it was fine. So it does fit really well. Honestly, I think this fits on my head way better than a factory made one because the ear tabs are like right where I need them to be. It's not too loose. It just fits really good. Um, so and definitely check out Peerless. They have some good hair. Like I said, this is super long, but it came out really pretty and I like it a lot, honeys. Love you guys. Let me know what you think of this one. And as always, stay diva and divalicious. Make sure you rate this video with a thumbs up because you love me so much. And you guys know I'm a hard worker. I work hard, okay? I love you guys and I'll see you in a soon to come video.